Okay, it's Monday. Welcome. New dev vlog uh, starting today. I'm gonna try and be better about filming and not just piecing together bits of code and like little snippets of mostly my dog. Um, I wanna be, I wanna be here. I wanna show what I'm doing and I wanna, you know, make make a log of my memories, what I'm actually doing. So today I just finished up my game dev stream. We're on day 29. Today is Monday, June 29th. So I have one more day of my 30 days of game dev and then we're all done. And then I'm gonna switch over to my new schedule, which I posted in my July plan with me. So go check that out if you haven't already. Uh, I'm gonna have some lunch and then I think I will do uh, some more game development just to finish up what I worked on on stream. We had a crash of Unity that then it wouldn't open the project anymore. So I had to fix that and it took up a bit of time. Um, so I really wanna get this piece done and working on. I'm working on a node editor for the AI. So basically just an editor window with like nodes that have lines connecting them. So we can visualize how the behaviors in this AI all connect together. Uh, but for now, I'm gonna make some lunch, get into that. Um, I was supposed to take today off of streaming in the evening, but I really wanna play Satisfactory. It's been super fun. It's just a factory building game set in an alien world. And it's just, it really sucked me in. So I'm gonna probably play some of that tonight. I'm very excited to be at the end of my 30 days and just see all the stuff that I've done. It's really, really, really good. I like it. I feel very accomplished. So a little recap of what I got done near the end of June, since I did skip my previous vlog, is a couple of things. A couple of things, mostly visual things, and then I started on the AI system that I'm going to be talking about for most of today. So I got the object highlighting done. So objects are highlighted when you are next to them, when you're targeting them. I did a very cute rain animation. I seriously love this. It's so adorable. It just uh, creates rain. And then it also creates this little like bubbly, sparkly type thing that comes up from the ground a little bit after the rain starts to sort of symbolize that the plants are being watered. I also got the guardian's home complete. It's sort of this like tower, laboratory, magic place, uh, purple and stone. Very cool. I worked, I worked on this for a couple days actually. The I fixed my terrain shader uh, when I converted everything to use the uh, universal render pipeline. I kind of messed up my previous terrain shader, so I redid it. And now we have this like outline around the different textures. It's still not perfect. There's another little bug I need to fix, but it looks so much better and I like it a lot. And then finally, I worked on the actual code for the AI system. And in code, it's basically a bunch of options and each of the options are scored for how much utility they'll provide. So they're each given a score and then the character picks the thing with the highest score. It's pretty simple. Okay, today is Tuesday, June 30th, so the last day of my game dev challenge here. Well, so it's the last day of streaming every day, but it is not the last day I will be doing game dev. Um, I will keep doing that until the game is done or, or some other priority comes up, but it's about 12 noon, um, so I'm just getting ready for stream. I have a phone call today with someone about a job position. I don't think it's like an interview phone call. I think it's just like a, like see if you're qualified phone call or see if you're interested, I guess would be another way of looking at it. But um, what was I gonna say next? I don't remember. I stayed up really late trying to finish that node editor I was working on. I didn't quite get it done. But I got pretty close, so I'm gonna see if I can finish that up before stream, and then either do some AI building, like make some AI stuff, or just do some 3D modeling. Um, I have a lot of art to make. Gosh, the light has changed so drastically in the past 30 seconds. Um, but I have a lot of art to make. I have a lot of 
Just a lot of stuff to do. A lot of stuff. Um, so, gotta get ready. This is the node editor used to build the NPC behaviors or the AI, you know, the stuff that makes decisions for what the characters should do. You can add nodes to this sort of graph. You can move them around. You can delete them. Uh, you can change the names of them to just make them more meaningful to the person who is setting all this up. Uh, connect them. So, so the top level nodes will be given scores first. And then if they're selected, they'll score all their child nodes, the ones that they're connected to. We can save and we can load. Um, this isn't super user friendly because I don't have a good way to select the objects and like load them in. I have to actually type the path. Ultimately, the AIs are saved as scriptable objects, and really it's just a big list of all the different nodes, what the actions and scores are for each of them, where they're located on the graph, like in visual space. Um, you know, just save that out to a file so we can load it up when we want to run it. Uh, Unity's graph view made this very easy, but there was still a lot to sort of figure out and a lot to make work together. So this was a pretty big project, but now that it's done, we can build up our behaviors and it's all pretty easy. Again, vlogging really got away from me, but I still feel like I got so much done. I had a blast doing my 30 day game dev stream challenge, but I did change my schedule in July, so I'm doing more game streaming. I'm just doing more streaming in general, but I'm kind of splitting up my days, so I'm not doing so many um, split streams where I do development and games in the same day. It was just a lot. Okay, hello. Um, it's Wednesday. The cat is very, very needy again, um, which, which is fine. He He's a very snuggly kitty. Um, I finished my game dev challenge. I streamed every day for 30 days. I think I already mentioned that. Um, and today is Wednesday, the next day, the first day of July. And I haven't done any game dev yet today because I woke up pretty close to my stream time, which was at 11, and went until 5 p.m. My longest uh, continuous stream yet. And in fact, I think maybe the longest I've streamed in a day so far. It was about six hours and I I felt pretty good. I played Satisfactory. It was a lot of fun. It was, in fact, satisfactory to me. Um, and then I'm just waiting for a grocery delivery to show up. And uh, I did some walking to get my cardio in. I, I walked up and down the stairs a little bit, but I got kind of dizzy. Like the, the turning and walking while I was reading was too much. And I really wanted to read this book. Um, I ended up walking on flat ground so I didn't fall to my death. But um, tonight my plan is to play a game of TFT, maybe two, and then um, I think I'm going to do some game dev after that. I got the AI working last night. Late last night I think um, it was like the last thing I did before bed. Uh, and now I can actually start building it out. Um, so I don't know. I might save the AI stuff for stream tomorrow, maybe not. Um, I haven't done art in a little bit, and that usually, people usually engage with that a little better because it doesn't take technical knowledge to understand what I'm doing. Um, at least I assume that's why. Moving the streams earlier in the day I think will help me a lot. Have time to do things and kind of enjoy dinner a little bit more than, it's not a rush. So that's my plan for tonight. I ended my week by planning out next week. Interviews for jobs are kind of piling up. I didn't really mean to schedule them all for the same week. It's just sort of how it happened um, because like I applied places uh, gradually, but then they all got back to me at the same time. So next week's going to be busy. I probably won't be able to do another vlog next week just because it's a lot, and then the interview process is sort of emotionally taxing as well. It's a lot of preparation, and then um, afterwards I just want to be done with everything. So that's going to be it for this video. Thank you so much for watching. If you want to catch some dev streams live, don't forget to follow me over on Twitch. Or, you know, I do game streams as well, and sometimes we even play games. 
where we're running a development company in the game. So that's meta. Uh, but thanks again. I hope to see you here next time with my next video, which hopefully isn't too long from now. Um, I hope you have a good day. I hope things are going well for you. And I will see you next time. Bye-bye.